Hi, Brentek here, where tech is made simple. So over the last couple of weeks, I've posted two videos on possible workarounds to install Windows 11 24H2, which is this year's annual feature update, which is still uh, being tested in preview on unsupported hardware. Now, I'll leave those two videos in the end screen if you'd like more info. But just to let you know that another workaround now has been spotted once again by Bob Pony, who posted recently over on X, that if you are a Windows 8 user and you don't have a PC compatible with Windows 11, you can also upgrade now by selecting, and if we head to a screenshot posted, and as you can see, by selecting to install Windows 11 version 24H2 IoT Enterprise Edition during the OS setup. And apparently with this as well, um, you can do so without losing data and apps that will be kept safe during the upgrade. So there is just another possible workaround. If you do have your hands on a preview version of Windows 11 24H2 RO Enter IoT Enterprise, but obviously your Enterprise Editions lack a couple of the features that your um, consumer editions um have regarding Windows 11. So always just keep that in mind. It is kind of stripped down a little bit in some aspects, so you won't get all the features. And just something to take note of is that obviously um, if you have a really old processor, which I think um, a lot of Windows 8 machines would have, um, you must probably um, will need POPCNT or SSE 4.2 instructions, which I've posted on. And I'll leave that video down below in the description if you'd like more info regarding that. So if your CPU doesn't meet SSE 4.2 or POPCNT population count, then obviously um, this still won't work because Microsoft is blocking those old processors from upgrading to Windows 11 24H2. So um, just another way the system requirements on Windows 11 can be bypassed. Um, in case you would be interested. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.